I'm Jen Jarrell, and this is episode number 26 of Still Place Like Home, where I talk with groups, individuals, and small businesses in and around our community. And today we are talking to Larry Stone from Curtis Septic. Hi, Jen. How are you? Good. Great to see you. Thank you for doing this. I know it was, I know you've been ridiculously busy. You know the market. The market's nuts, right? It's, it's crazy, yeah. Mm -hmm. And as far as um, homeowners are concerned, um, one of the things that we see a lot is uh, people try to save money on pumping their septic systems. Mm -hmm. And I guess the best way to equate to it is like changing the oil in your car. You mm -hmm. can save money initially by not changing the oil in your car too frequently, but you end up changing the engine sooner than needs to. And that's the same thing with a septic system. How long can a septic system last if you take care of it? Yeah, the average system lasts about 25 years. Mm -hmm. So a typical, so a typical family, let's say a family of four, um, how, how often would they, is that how you usually go by the number of people in your house? Um, by how often you, you have to get your tank cleaned, flushed? Yeah, good question. Um, different, different families have different habits as far as, um, you know, what they're cooking. Cooking's mm -hmm. a huge factor. Some families may cook at home all the time and maybe, uh, uh, you know, dumping more grease down the drain, just washing your plates and so forth, throwing them in the dishwasher, it still ends up in the septic system. Mm -hmm. um, so the, the, end, the end, really the way to do it um, is once, like when we pump it, we measure the amount of solids in the tank, which is the greases, oil, and fats uh, flow to mm -hmm. the top in the sludge dead bacteria bottom and it when mm -hmm. we measure it with a sludge judge if it's 25 percent is is the time to pump it so we we set a frequency um and after we've pumped your tank mm -hmm. by by the usage because different people are different uh, right right yeah. okay and i i want to tell a quick story if you don't mind so um i'm in, a real estate agent as you know and when i first started um i had a client that needed to get a title five which everybody needs when you're selling your house so i had um curtis septic come out and do perform a title five check the system to make sure it was okay um it was not and I think we kind of knew that before you even came. And there were, there were just like any situation, things don't always go as planned and things happen. So there was a situation and I remember calling you and telling you or seeing you and telling you what happened. And uh, the reason that I refer you all of the time is because you fixed the problem and um, have continued to check in and see how things are going. And to me, uh, as a small business myself, working for myself, I appreciate working with another small business and I know that things happen. And the fact that you fixed it was um, meant a lot to me and to my clients as well. So um, we have to live by our relationships, you know, how they are. Yes. And yes. Uh, so a lot of times, if you know, we'll do things that are, uh, we'll, we'll go, we'll go the extra mile for people that are having troubles, um, that, you know, it might not even be a customer of ours or something we're going to make, uh, any money on ourselves because we're just help helping people out. That's why I went to work for this company a long time ago. 